Earth. Over time, it has changed and developed to host life, and it all starts with primary succession. Glaciers or volcanic activity destroy the land with their glacial retreat and lava. There is no soil, only rocks left behind. Early colonizers like lichen begin to come in and with the help of weathering, break down the rocks into soil. Once the soil is created, nitrogen fixing plants come in and increase the nitrogen levels in the soil. This leads to the arrival of other plants like mosses and small shrubs. Soon, larger plants are growing and the environment is thriving. Secondary succession begins when disturbance, such as a fire, comes and temporarily inhibits the growth. Although the plants have, for the most part, been wiped out by the fire, the ashes bring in mineral nutrients which makes the soil more fertile. Pioneer species, such as fireweed and other R-selected species, begin to grow and colonize the area. This leads to the growth of softwood trees like alders. Facilitators like spruce, who drop their spruce needles, lower the pH of the soil and make it easier for hardwood trees and big plants to grow. With big trees in the ecosystem, smaller plants receive more shade and experience a decrease in temperature, which will lower the overall biodiversity of the ecosystem.